Real Life Cinderella How Ola Jumoke Became the World's Sensation. Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. We all know the Cinderella story, but do you know that we have several Cinderella stories every now and then? This is the story of Ola Jumoke. Ola Jumoke Orisaguna is a former Nigerian bread seller and model who achieved overnight fame after she was photographed by T.Y. Bello while hawking bread on the streets of Lagos. Ola Jumoke's story quickly went viral, with many people loading her as an inspiration. She was subsequently offered a modeling contract and has since gone to appear in various art campaigns and magazine covers. In our today's video, we are going to cover up this entire story. But before we get in, make sure you've subscribed to our channel. Also, don't forget to ring the bell icon so you won't miss any updates. Ola Jumoke's story is a heartwarming reminder that anything is possible with hard work and determination. Despite coming from humble beginnings, she has received tremendous success and is an inspiration to others. Ola Jumoke Oristaguna, born February 25, 1989, is a Nigerian former bread seller turned model who rose to prominence after she was discovered by T.Y. Bello on the street while he was taking a photo of a singer, Tiny Temper. Orisaguna was born in Okrika, River State, Nigeria, to parents of Yoruba ethnicity. She is the second child in the family of seven children. Her father, Sunday Orisaguna, was a fisherman, while her mother, Elizabeth Orisaguna, was a petty trader. The family resided in the Iyana Ipaja area of Lagos, where Ola Jumoke hogs bread to make out a living. Ola Jumoke had no formal education as she dropped out of school after her primary education due to financial difficulties. Before her newfound fame, she worked as a bread seller on the streets of Lagos. In January 2016, T.Y. Bello spotted Ola Jumoke while he was taking pictures of British rapper Tiny Temper during the photo shoot of This Day Style magazine. Ola Jumoke photobombed the shoot and T.Y. Bello took notice of her. He then took some shots of her and posted them on his Instagram page. The photos went viral and Ola Jumoke became an overnight sensation. She was subsequently signed by Few Model Management and has since gone on to model for brands such as Payport and Elan International among others. In February of 2016, Ola Jumoke was featured on the cover of This Day Style magazine alongside Tiny Temper. She has also graced the covers of other magazines such as Ovation, Complete Fashion, Genevieve, Ventures Africa, Prestige and so much more. Ola Jumoke's rags to riches story has inspired many people, both locally and internationally. In May 2016, she was honored by the Nigerian Senate for her achievements. She was also awarded the keys to the city of Lagos by Governor Akin Wunmi Ambode. This super lady has been caught in some controversies. Orisaguna declared herself shocked by the fact that people are gay and have the right to marry persons of the same sex. She said that she does not understand how two men or two women can be together and that she does not support it. This generated a lot of backlash from the LGBT community and their allies, with many people accusing her of homophobia. There's been no response from Orisaguna herself since the controversy erupted. It remains to be seen how this will affect her career going forward. Ola Jumoke, a former bread seller who shot to fame after being featured in a photo with international superstar model Tyra Banks, has been embroiled in controversy after she was quoted as saying that there is no such thing as a Nigerian born gay or lesbian. The quote which was said in the Yoruba language caused outrage among many Nigerians who feel that it is homophobic and goes against the country's constitution, which guarantees equality for all citizens, regardless of sexual orientation. Ola Jamuke has since apologized for her comments, saying that she did not mean to offend anyone and that she does not believe that being gay or lesbian is wrong. Despite her apology, the damage has been done and Ola Jamuke's name has now been dragged through the mud. Many people have labeled her as homophobic and say that she's not a true representation of the Nigerian people. 
Besides this controversy, there was another tragedy that took place in Ola Jomoke's life. This bread seller turned model's fortune, took a leap from all the modeling contracts, scholarships, endorsement deals, and tours. She was literally crowned for a good time period, living in a luxury flat that was originally owned by the real estate firm's CEO, Siju Moto. Ola Jomoke used to live in that apartment for five years straight without getting charged for it. While living in that apartment, she started her own vlog channel on YouTube named Ola Jomoke Sauce. In her vlogs, she used to tell her stories to the audience, but instead of talking in English, she opted for her native English. Most people think that due to her lack of education and inability to communicate with the audience in English, she couldn't hold her channel. However, in her opinion, that's completely wrong, since the channel went on for like 5 years. Ola Jumoke anchored her channel and held the A's for a good period of time, and then it was rested. Well, things started to take a downturn in her life when her marriage life got a bit complicated since the model started having problems with her former husband. According to sources, the model's husband, Sunday Orisaguna, was quite frustrated because he was having a hard time living with a lady he had been tied to for more than four years. According to her husband, Ola Jemuke stopped respecting her husband like she did before and also started to come home late. Orisaguna accused Ola Jumoke of being rude after the fortune found her and she got the fame. Moreover, due to this statement, the strong modeling career of Ola Jumoke suffered a lot. This Cinderella clearly denied all the allegations that her husband made and said that only God knows whatever is going on in their lives and he is the only one who can judge them. After a few months, Ola Jumoke also removed Orisaguna's name from her name which confirmed that the two lovebirds were now separated. However, there were still some people who supported the choice. Many people believe that despite her newfound fame and success, Ola Jumoke remains humble and down to earth. In an interview with This Day Style, she said of her experience, I never expected any of this to happen to me. I'm still the same Ola Jumoke from the breadline. I have not changed. A lot of people are concerned about the model's whereabouts and worried for her since she suddenly disappeared from the public eye. Ola Jumoke, the mom of two kids, deleted all her social media accounts before disappearing. She lastly updated them in the year 2019. However, the only Facebook page was lastly updated in 2020. Some reliable sources have said that the absence of Ola Jumoke is connected with the fact that now she doesn't want to earn money to some extent. One of the main reasons could be that Nigerians are mainly not interested in wasting their precious time while stepping into another big game. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to our channel and turn notifications so you don't miss out on any of our videos.